Hello everyone, so I'm gonna edit more photos uh, and I have postponed all my photo shoots so um, I will have some more BTS uh, later once everything is settled down from this uh, uh, situation and um, from now I'm just uh, edit since we, everyone is like stay at home and I'm just gonna edit a couple more old photos uh, just record some old photos uh, editing um, because I have some more old photos I haven't been edited like I haven't edited them yet uh, so it's a good time just uh, go through all my old photos and then select some of them to edit so this one was the, from last year and um, I'm gonna edit a couple more from this uh, post from uh, Vipula Baby so let's get started I'm gonna use uh, what I have used recently just to edit some old photo and sometimes I got inspiration that oh um, I have been using this technique and then just uh, to try on the old photos and when you are editing the old photos uh, you might recognize some of the things that um, inspire you at that time so sometimes it helps just to edit some old photos and it helps inspiration as well so I'm just add a couple more and then um, I might divide it into multiple video like last week as well and let's um, see how it goes and because right now everyone in the US is like uh, stay shelter uh, I mean one one third two third of population or something and it's getting um, it's still uh, they're trying to control the situation so um, I have to work from home uh, from the weekdays because I'm a programmer, uh, developer. Uh, I can do remote work uh, right now and pre uh, pretty grateful that I have remote uh, full time for now. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna patch a couple of spots uh, just slightly. And this, this was by the uh, GM lens uh, I use and i'm gonna change let's see what kind of color maybe uh standard i'm gonna use the uh sony standard base for now i i know that sony has a uh, stronger yellow but i'm gonna remove it the green as well make it slightly more toward the yellow side you can see the difference okay I'm gonna smooth the skin a little bit more because it's backlight I'm not gonna do the whole um, thing just uh, the portraiture 3 so I'm gonna just, just gonna do the slightly smooth the skin okay and then adjust the exposure a little bit more I need to keep track of the time also so I put that screen flow recorder to keep track of the time just to make sure that I'm on time um, for the recording and just add a little bit so for the Instagram crop 4x5 Okay, so I need some shadow in the front. And then reduce the highlights. Maybe slightly one more time. Okay. Okay, that's good. And 
me see it. Vibrant. It's a little bit more vibrant, but um, I can uh, reduce the blue also. Okay, so that's that's good. And then Control Shift Export. I'm gonna copy this one and then paste it here. I'm gonna do the um, soften the skin first. Okay, so reduce slightly more exposure and then change to shadow and give a little bit more of the shadow in front. Kind of like this. Slightly crop, make sure that it still has some headroom on the top. Okay, so this is good. And then control shift. I'm gonna see one um, hair flip one. Because of the mood, I'm gonna reduce the exposure even more. Just the uh, um, to have a stronger mood on the hair four by five I'm trying to use four by five so it has more room in here And I like the yellow in here, so let me see what's gonna leave the green because it has a sprint style. And then a little bit more vibrance. Get the shadow going in front. Okay, so this one I can try to just use a quick portraiture three, just to for the quick um, skin tone. see if it's too much if it's too much okay yeah the the sharpness is too much um, reduced so I'm just gonna do it manually so it depends if the sharpness stay there I'm just um, if it's too much reduced by the portraiture 3 I'm just doing a quick manual adjustment in here because I want the hair is um, to have a sharp feeling in here and then the motion from the hair slightly adjust the okay I like the bokeh in this part um, it's nice um, here and reduce okay 
Okay, so it, this is good and create some room negative space in here. So save this one. And then this is 10 minute mark. I'm gonna do one last one. I'm gonna do the patch soft and the skin first in here. So I'm switching between the patching and uh, smoothing the skin for this part of the area and then gonna paste the one that we have I'm gonna do the shadow Okay, so I'm gonna do the softening the skin just slightly here. Okay, so that's good. I'm gonna do the Instagram 4x5 crop. negative space on the top instead so one more shadow okay so that's good and just shift export okay so I will have more um, in the next video so because the time is 30 minutes I'm just want to keep under the 15 minute mark Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more video coming up. Bye.